Hey guys, the Hawk36 here, and this is a special little let's play I'm doing of uh, Wayne Gretzky's 3D Hockey. Seeing as the uh, NHL playoffs have just started, and uh, I figured it would be fun just to play my probably my favorite hockey game of all time because of its uh, crazy arcadeness and uh, just over the top, over the top, just disregard for general simulation rules. It's a uh, it's a fun game, so uh, we're gonna get started here. We're gonna pick our team. I'm gonna pick the Bruins, being from Boston. It feels fitting, you know. Pick the Bruins. We're we'll gonna play Buffalo Sabres. Uh, I think I gotta pick Cam Neely because uh, he looks to be the best guy on this roster. So we're gonna pick Cam Neely and we're gonna play the Buffalo Sabres and see what we can do. Now, here's a little uh, background of this game I would like to talk about. We got a. It was developed by Atari Games for the arcade in 1996, and then later in uh, October 31st of 96, it was ported over to the Nintendo 64. And there, I got my first goal. As I was mentioning, uh, this crazy arcade style, there's going to be a lot of high-scoring games. So uh, in regular hockey games, you know, maybe you get like three or four goals tops. This game, you can get like 8, 9, 10. I've seen games high in the teens. Look, another goal. As I'm talking, you know, I, I like how it, uh, it answers. So, yeah, big arcade play on this game. It was actually what I found most interesting, according to Wikipedia, was that it was the first ever four-player game for the Nintendo 64. I find that very hard to believe, but I guess it is. I mean, I know, like, Mario Kart came out, you know. There was Mario Party and stuff like that. I mean, but I, I don't know, man. You look that up. That's that's what it said online. So uh, I'm just repeating what I've seen. Uh, as you've seen, this there's been a few things I I do. It says like power shots and whatever. Basically, all the moves in this game are power related. That Buffalo's gonna have a little two two. See, she scored pretty fast. Um, power. Like I said, there's some power shots. Which turn the nets to fire if you score. There's power checks, which makes ambulances go across the screen, which is pretty funny. I remember I'd always see that. I don't know if I get it in this play, but me and my friend used to play this all the time. We just beat the hell out of the opponents. We just check guys all the time. And uh, you get a lot of ambulance hits. And uh, basically, that's how you start fights in this game. And I'm pretty sure I get a fight in this let's play so that's uh, pretty exciting that's one of my favorite parts of the game to be honest just getting into fights you know I said the power shot power check oh the, the funniest I don't know if this happens but there's like a uh, literally like you're taking a shot and if you get a power save like the goalie literally turns into a brick wall so it's like you can't get it past them which I always found to be hilarious I remember playing it again a couple months ago one of my friends, and he's like, dude, that's not even fair. It just turns right into a brick wall. And there, there we go. There was the power shot I was talking about. You see the fire truck come out. It's funny. If you listen to the commentators in this, too, they always, uh, it always made me laugh. One of the funny, one of the funnier lines to me, I don't know why, it was, uh, he's like, oh, Robin Hood and his merry men are up to it again. I don't know if they say that in this Let's Play, but, uh, look out for that. As you see, coming into the first period, we get five seconds left. Four, three... Two, do I get a goal? Yes, I do. <laughs> Lovely. Four to four. Look at that. Four to four in the first period. That's some crazy. That's some crazy stuff, man. That's what I like about this game, though. It's the end of the first period. Let's see. Two goals. All right. Let's do this. Second period. I'm pretty sure this game goes up to like eight or nine points. But uh, we'll see. Just a lot of uh, nostalgia for me about this game. I think this is like the first hockey game I've really ever played. Besides, ma besides maybe uh, a Blades of Glory, Blades of Steel for the NES. I remember playing that over a friend's house. But back in the day, back in my day, I I played mostly NES, and then I went over to N64. I never had the Super Nintendo when I was younger. So I had like my uncle's old NES. So I, but, I, but with that, I, all I really remember playing all the time was like Super Mario Brothers and Zelda 2 and Jackal, you know, just the, the classic games. And we got a hat trick, that's pretty pimp. You know, just, just the classics. I don't, I don't know if I play Blades of Steel until later in life, but who knows. But uh, yeah, this, this, whenever I think of hockey games, I, I think of Wayne Gretzky's 3D Hockey. 
<laughs> Another goal, six to four. Uh, it's just it brings back uh, just brings back my childhood. I don't know. But yeah, the, yeah, just like in a NHL fashion, you got look at all these uh, advertisements on the side. Of course, you got Nintendo Williams. Oh, here's the fight. This is what I was waiting for, guys. Look at this. I think I cleaned the shit out of this guy. Watch, right, boom, boom. I think you just hit A and B to, to do the shots and uh. I like the one when you uh, just you pick the guy up and you just start beating the hell out of him. It's it's fun. I don't even think you get penalties either, you know? I think you just fight for the hell of it. Like once you check enough guys, they just fight. I guess I forgot to mention some of the uh, buttons in this game. Well, like, I'm sure uh, the C, C down button was the boost. So you gotta use the boost. Like, you see the little meter under the H-A-W, like my name? I think once that goes up to full power, you can use your boost to go through, as Peppy would say. I like to use that whenever I get it. Um, I'm pretty sure like the the right trigger on the N64 controller lets you switch to a uh, player that's the closest or something. It's like if I was uh, or switch to the guy with the puck. Like if the light the light blue is the computer guy, like the star blue, the blue star is me. I think if you had another player, it would be like a yellow star or something. But yeah, so uh, uh, switch the players. Obviously, shoot is A. If you hold back, you do a slap shot. They just got a friggin' sweet fire goal on me, dude. Six to five. Um, the checks, I'm pretty sure there are two different types of checks, maybe three. But I know C, right, and left were two different types of checks that I always use. B is pass, although like I'm usually an asshole and I never pass in this game. I just kind of... Uh, just kind of like boost through and just shoot whenever I can, or just switch to the guy. So I don't, I really don't pass that much. I mean, I guess, as you see, like the computer was doing earlier, like they just set up plays. They'll do like two or three passes and just like shoot, and they usually get it in. But me, I don't know. I just, I'd rather just go right up to the goalie one on one and just take a slap shot. That's, that's, it's a matter of your preference. Damn, they, they uh, tied it up again on me, huh? Yeah, it's a. Uh, it's a fun, it's a fun little game. Like if you uh, you know, like on check it out on eBay or go to a yard sale or something. I'd recommend uh, picking this game up, getting some friends together. You know, have a few drinks and uh, play some Wayne Gretzky 3D hockey. If you're uh, if you're a hockey fan, if you're a fan of arcade games such as like Blitz or whatever, it's it's in the vein. It's in the same vein as that. You know, it's just uh, it's a cool game. See, as you can see, the computer is the red. We got a minute 14. I think the period, were they uh, three minutes or two minutes? I don't I'm watching it while I'm just doing this commentary, so uh, you tell me. Ah, <laughs> oh, there we go, seven to seven. I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure I end up victorious on this. I uh, got a minute to score. I, I hope I can uh, come through with it, you know? Just take some shots. I probably have a lot of shots by the end of the game. I, I'll check out the stats as soon as the uh, period ends. So going up. There we go. Eight to seven. Yeah, I think. See, I think this is gonna be the final. I think I uh, just try to like run out the clock. You know, just kind of skate around like <laughs> like a jerk and just uh, take a couple shots. Check some guys. I'm. I'm really excited about that, that I got to show you guys the fight though. That's literally my favorite part is, of the game. As a kid, like me and my friends would literally just beat the shit out of the other guys just in hopes of getting into a fight. Because I think like the more you check the guys, the greater the percentage that you're going to be in a fight. It just happens. I mean, in typical fashion, it makes sense. In hockey, like guys get pissed at other guys and they just start fighting. So I mean, it makes sense. But yeah, if you're looking for a hockey game with more realism. This might not be the one for you. I think it said online that there is a mode that that is more realistic, but how much realistic can this game be, right? <laughs> well, game over. I won eight to seven. Go Bruins, right? <laughs> so yeah, eight eight goals. Wow, twelve shots for Cam Neely. That's impressive. All right, guys. Well, thanks for tuning in for my Wayne Gretzky's 3D Hockey Let's Play, and I hope to see you back for some more Let's Plays. See you later, guys.